Movies, movies, and more movies. Yes, we have another film festival to tell you about, but this one is the first of its kind. Here with the inside scoop is the co-founder of FamFest, actor, producer, writer, and director, the talented Mr. Corey Jackson. <laughs> Hey, how you doing? Thank I'm you for fine, having me. Mr. Jackson. Happy Monday to you. Happy Monday. All right, so this is the first Fam Fest ever. So who better to it, tell us the inspiration behind it and what the goal and mission of this festival is than you, Mr. Jackson? Because you and two other brilliant minds came up with this. Absolutely, yeah. My my co-producers, uh, Devin Hack and Cara Patterson, um, a few years ago, came up with this idea that we just wanted to take more initiative and. In, in creating stories centered or, you know, centering people of color and, and how we tell them. And so we started Fam Creative. And uh, with a generous grant from the New York City Arts Artist Corps, uh, this, we are hosting our first annual film festival, mini film festival today at uh, Quad Cinema at 34 West 13th Street. Uh, and we've got a great slate of, of films uh, that center people of color, uh, both in front of and behind the camera. And we're really excited. Oh, uh, we're, got, we're excited too, sir. Because right. I'm glad to hear that. Because you know festivals like this usually involve screenings and panels and more screenings. So tell us some of the events and screenings you have planned for today. Absolutely. So there's two blocks. Uh, one is our first is our art house matinee at two o'clock, featuring a actually a film staged reading of a classic Bill Gunn play called Black Picture Show mm -hmm. uh, that uh, was a, directed by a way tempo and uh, was commissioned by Artist Space, the Artist Space Gallery downtown. Uh, earlier this summer, they were doing an exhibit on on Bill Gunn's work called uh, "Till They Listen." Bill Gunn directs America, and they commissioned uh, a film stage reading of that play, that play of his that was uh, originally produced by the Public Theater and was at the Vivian Beaumont. Um, it's featuring Andre Holland and Jason Bowen in uh, alternating the roles of father and son. It's a beautiful story, and so we're excited to to feature that in the matinee slot at 2 p.m followed by a Q&A with uh, the director, uh, Wei Tempo, and a, and a couple of cast members. And then tonight at 7, we've got a curated selection of 10 short films mm -hmm. called Shorts That Shine, uh, which is just a beautiful, I think, array of, of different stories centering people of color that we're excited to, to just enjoy with a, with a, great, a great group of folks. And, and a lot of the artists are going to be there, and we're excited to, to see it all come together. And that's also followed uh, by a a panel discussion about representation in media uh, in front of and behind the camera. So we're excited about that as well. All right, Mr. Jackson, I've been told, I've been told, I didn't make this up, that I'm clairvoyant. So okay. my sixth sense is telling me that everyone watching right now wants to know one thing, where they can get tickets or how they can attend. Yeah. Please tell us. Absolutely. Um, so because it's the day, today mm -hmm. is it, yo. So, uh, so one, you can go to the website, which um, is on their FAM, FAM Creative. Yeah, it's right there, dot Productions slash FAM Fest. For a couple more hours, we'll, we'll be accepting reservations on there. Now, the evening shorts that shine is, is almost sold out, so there's only a, a few seats left for that. So if you're thinking about joining us, please uh, go ahead and, and make that reservation. There is some room um, in, in the matinee, um, but also you can just show up. Uh, okay. You know, you can show up at the theater, and, and we will, you know, we will accommodate you. I, I think that we will we'll be able to get everyone in uh so yeah just 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 come on down and and let us let us have fun all right so uh sir fans most recently got to see you on godfather of harlem and many still remember you from house of cards but you don't just okay. work in front of the camera but behind the scenes which you do for a few projects that we're going to see at fan fest correct yes correct. what are they uh so a uh, fan creative started with uh, a first uh f short film that i directed and uh called the soul variations which was a short film made of some poems that were written by a friend of my actor and, and writer himself, Kareem Lucas, who will be there this evening. A part of that film, uh, The Key Change, will be seen tonight in the Shorts That Shine section. And it's also streaming on uh, the All Arts uh, Network and streaming platform right now. Uh, people can see the full film there. So uh, I directed that. I've also okay. produced uh, a couple of other of the pieces that will be seen tonight. Uh, Cupids, which just was uh, recently uh, aired on BET and CBS as part of the Tribeca Widen the Screen initiative uh, with PNG and Saturday Morning, which was um, a lot of uh, fun to work on. And then 
Uh, also, uh, The Mark, uh, which will also be featured tonight, also written and directed by my co-producing partner, Devin Hack. Uh, we also uh, produced that. So, okay. so we've collaborated on, on, on several of these projects. Big We're really things. excited. In addition to all the projects we, we didn't have any producing part in, which will also be uh, exciting yes. to uh, see this evening. Of course. Big things, big things. See, when I said you're the talented Mr. Jackson, I was not joking. He acts, <laughs> writes, produces, directs. Uh, Guess who doesn't do any of that? This one. Oh, but it well, hey, is... it's, it's no time like the present. Come on, you know? Okay. What, what are we waiting on? Oh, yeah. I know but... you have projects ready. All right, sure. I do not. But, Corey, right. such a pleasure to meet you, and we cannot wait to have you back for the second annual FAMFAST. But okay. good luck Thank on today. So have a good day, okay?